Hello, how is it going people? YouTube, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to, this is Train Sim, is it Train Sim World 2? Uh, as far as trains go, I'm not like a, I'm not one of these train enthusiasts, but I quite enjoy, I enjoy the game, I think it's quite a chilled um, sort of game. So we've got some, this is the Glasgow uh, Central line, so I might do, I quite fancy, now is that difficulty? In terms of the the bars, yeah, I think that's maybe. Oh, is that the time that it takes as well? Ah, so some of these are actually quite long. Um, yeah, that one seems. I think that must be difficulty. So. I quite fancy doing this. Drich, a drich day in Scotland is just basically horrible, like wet. So I may actually do that. I've done like, the extra time. So I actually get quite a good score for that. I get 10,000. Uh, what's the other one I've done? I thought I'd done more of these. I think there's some... Wait till I just go back? Because I think there is... Uh, yeah, there's timetables. So I've probably done... Um, I think I've done some of these. Yeah, I've done that one, which I got eleven thousand. That was Glasgow. That's like the, the round the whip that you do. And then there's another one I've done. I think I've done clockwise and anti-clockwise. Yeah, there it is. There. Um. So we'll probably do, I might just do some of the scenarios, so I'm trying to think what one I really want to do. That, that one's like 75 minutes, that's quite a long one. Um, I'm thinking like, these ones are quite hard. Pure Baltic is another Scottish term. <laughs> Fat right, we'll do this one. Pure Baltic just means cold. And it's in Scotland, so the weather's probably really quite accurate. It's a pure Baltic. Which I think is quite a, a fascinating term. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh. Yeah, lovely. Yep, that's Scottish weather. Right, here we go. Let's get the master key in. Uh, tail lights, I think it's headlights and marker lights. Unlock the doors, we're on the right hand, or the left hand side, sorry. So here we go, wooden passengers. So a lot of this is the time that we need to be careful on, so I'm going to put, get the, the brake release and get ready to rock and a roll. I'd close the doors. In fact, let's just nip out and see what's happening. Oh, yeah, it's a nice Scottish day. Beautiful. Beautiful! Close the doors. Oh, the train coming. Oh. Oh, my thing's not working. Oh, I'm in. Okay. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh, I need to go forward. Right, let's get the power, let's get rolling. It's time to get going. The weather is getting worse. There's a there's a shocker. So Kirk, Kirk Hill at 11.04. Let's punch the power to four, let's get a bit of... I don't know whether that's really what you should be doing. Oh, do you know what I need? Oh. Let's get it down to two, let's get the wipers on. Where is the wipers? Um, our wipers are here. I think we need to go fast. Oh, yeah. That's looking good. Let's go three. So there's a 40 mile an hour limit. Open up to 50 in a couple of yards. There's a 50 board there. I'm probably actually going to push 50. I just want to keep the time. Time is really quite... I mean, you don't really have much time to sort of, you know, 
mess about. So we're going to go to 50 here. Oh, it's, yeah, it's, it's no nice. Right. So everything's hunky dory dandy. We're coming up. Probably start cutting the power. Breaking, I'm still a little bit like. If I was cut the throttle. I'm a little bit not like perfect on breaking yet. We don't have any uh, speed restrictions coming up. Oh man, that's. Uh, lights. Okay. Maybe we should get some lights on. Right, we're coming up. Um, cab lights. I should probably start braking. Yeah, let's apply some brake. So I need to get my distance gauge, like, where we need to start braking. Because you want to be smooth. Apply another, another bit of brake. Yeah, this is actually looking quite good. Come off that. Okay, get ready with the doors. Okay, that wasn't too bad with time. Let's maybe let's see about maybe getting this this destination board. What's this reverse beam? Could do with more lights, to be honest. <clears throat> yeah, it's really looking horrible. Now right, let's get ready with these doors. Lock the doors. Take the brake off. Let's go. So next stop, Burnside, 1.4 miles. And I love no seven. Bit of graffiti there. Mhm. Mm so I find this game really relaxing. Um, it, it's just, you know, you don't have to be. It's not intense. You know, you can just sit and chill. It's, it's the control of it's quite quite easy. It's a game that I like to play sometimes just to kind of relax a little. I wonder if you can press that button. Yeah, it's maybe not a good idea. If passengers get unruly in the back, I'm just going to uncouple. Alright, I have no fiber actually. Well, I feel as if we're not too bad with time. Got a sun visor, I don't think we need the sun visor. That's just a guess at the moment. Let's cut the power because we're actually going downhill here. Let's start applying a little bit of brake. Again, you've got like a centre of gravity there, so if you brake too hard, I suppose that like the, the passengers will feel it. So you really need to be quite smooth on the brake. So I'm kind of getting my my distance is maybe still not perfect, but I'm I'm getting to know when I need to start braking from a certain speed. I'm still going downhill. I've got one percent downgrade or down. Down gradient or downhill, that's probably an easier way of putting it. Just gonna apply a little bit more brake, maybe go back down to one. Okay, we're coming in, maybe just. Ok, 
Okay, get ready with the doors. Well, uh, breaking wasn't perfect. Okay, doors are open. Set the break off. Um, see, we need to depart eleven oh seven set. Hold on. Oh, it's a down gradient. <gasps> Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, a disaster has, has struck. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, we're going to be behind time. I, I, cause we're in a 1% a, a downhill, I oh, started moving. <sighs> bad. Bad, bad, bad. Oops. That's an oopsie. It's a big oopsie. Okay, that's noted. Like we're actually kind of behind time now. Okay, we probably need to punch the, the gas, as they say. So I'm kind of maybe not going to be comfort level here. So Croft Foot is next, 1110. Yeah, we're kind of like, let's put us behind. Put us behind, so although we're not far from from cross foot, but okay, I'm just gonna apply a little bit of break. It's slightly downhill, but I need to get this breaking perfect. Maybe I don't think we're gonna make up much time, but we need to maybe make some perfect stops. Um. If you start breaking, it's hard to say really. Start playing a little bit of break now. Oh. Maybe go to step two. Oh. She's coming in hot. Hot potato. Yeah, that's not a good one. I'm not gonna lie, that ain't good. Oof. Right, we're uphill, so we could. I mean, I suppose technically we'd keep it on step one for the break. Oh, choo choo train. Hello, choo choo train. Ah, oh, 10th. Ah, we're, we're not bad. We've kind of. I wouldn't really say we've made up time, but... Right, let's get ready to close these doors. Break off. Punch it. Right, next stop is Kings Park. 0.7, so it's a very short hop. I mean, there's probably right ways to accelerate, like, I mean, proper acceleration, but I'm actually going to go as fast as I possibly can here, because we could make up a lot of time here. We need breaking is like I'm gonna go step one. Maybe punch step two soonish. Thirty seven, thirty six. Go step two. Ooh. Step three.
Yeah, that wasn't great either. We've kind of made up a bit of time, to be honest. We probably we didn't need to push that as much. But we're actually probably going to load the passengers and we're actually going to have to sit and wait, which is pretty good. Nope. Hey, I mean, it's raining, mate. You've not got an umbrella. Okay. Right, so... We're actually going to leave the doors, I'm going to leave the doors open to just before 13.30. Right, close the doors. Get the brake off. Let's go. Next stop is alongside 11.18. Again, I feel we're getting ahead of the curve here. So maybe we don't really need to, you know, be as, as as quick, or try and be as quick. Well, there's a 25. Ooh, I tell you, that, that was sneaky. That was very sneaky. That was just after the... That station there, a little 25 zone just to kind of keep you on your toes. I don't know if you're meant to peep. So that 1118 being only like just over a mile, it's kind of a bit of a false economy there because it's a, it's a 25 zone so we can't really get there fast. I'm going to punch it up to the 25 maybe just squeeze another little bit there we go oh oh there's a there's a 20 oh I tell you that is that's well sneaky that is I know I, I keep forgetting to look up at the the right hand side at the top it tells you when there's a there's a 40 zone coming up Excuse me. Uh, that 40 is coming up. I mean, by the time we get to the 40, we're going to be close to the station. We've actually got 2 minutes, 2 minutes 20 seconds to get there, which we we'll probably will speed up a little. There's the 40. I know it's... Oh. There we go. Maybe just speed up at a touch. I don't really think we need to, but... I feel with this game, if you're always ahead of the curve, it's really what it's all about. Uh, we've got a 30 zone coming up and 2 miles, so that's after the... Oh, there's a helicopter. Alright, let's start applying a little bit of brake. Yeah, but we are actually miles ahead. Step three. Okay. Release the doors. Well, we're actually ahead of time, so we're actually going to have to sit and wait here, which is kind of interesting. So this is actually I've I've been on these trains. Um, Scotrail. 
in Glasgow Central from Air. There's the Air Glasgow Central. So I, I haven't been up in Glasgow for a while. Um, so, but it's a train service that I have been on. I've not really done any of the Glasgow loop, but I've went from from Air to Glasgow. Yeah, it's not a pretty date. Do, 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 do. Probably just close the doors just now. I'll do it at 20, 25, 24. Right, let's get the brakes off. Off we go. So the next stop is, it's only 900 yards away, it's, it's Pollock Shaw's East. Uh, we've got a 30 zone coming up 1.9 miles, so that's, that's obviously under the, so it's a 40 zone, so we can actually get up to speed here. So we're 11.21 arrival. I had the first uh, train sim world, uh, and I bought the second one. It, it's, to be honest, it's a game that I quite enjoy just playing. It's it's totally different for, from any other game that you, that you play. I mean, most games are quite intense where you need to be like on the ball constantly. I need to start breaking. Again, it's just trying to gauge where you need to be. Like this feels. Did we go to step three? See, to me that was better. Man, we're, we're actually <clears throat> we've actually got ahead of the the whip here. Oh, there's a the high rise. Graphics are, are, are pretty decent. I mean, it's not... In a day like today, you really don't see much. Um, and the, these little uh, trains, there's actually one of these that... Uh, I think they put plants in them. Um, but yeah, there's a little train here at, at Air. So this was on sale. And it's kind of one that I've been sort of wanting to buy for a while. Um... I mean, Train Sim World. If if you spent like all the the upgrades, it would be it would come to quite a lot. Um, can I actually take a picture? Is is that even possible? Um, no. I thought there might have been a. I thought there might have been like a photo mode because I I like to take a, a screenshot for the. For the YouTube video. Actually, a little bit of time here. Could have had a sandwich. Kind of looks dodgy, didn't it? Hi. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Right. So let's get these doors closed. Passengers are loaded. Let's get the brakes off. Let's go. Shawlands at 11.23. It's only 637 yards away. Again, we're not. We're in the 30 zone. So we're, no, sorry, we're in a 40 zone. But the 30 zone's coming up just after we leave Shawlands, probably. To be honest, we really don't need to speed up too much. But sometimes, in, in some of the games... Wow, well, we need to be actually breaking. Um, some of the games, the, the times are very hard to keep. 
Oh, I'm breaking. Let's go. Let's go. Step two break. So it's coming in hot here. Oh, maybe three. Yeah, that was a little bit much. Yep. Yeah, we're actually really early. Well, I wouldn't say we're, we're, we're early, we're, we're a little bit early. Yeah, we had to get into emergency there. Right, don't take the brakes off because that's quite a steep incline. Oh, probably just made that. Yeah, that was close. fresh air. I suppose if you maybe let go of a bit of wind you could just open the, the, the window there. Right, let's get the brakes off. So Maxwell Park 11.25. Again it's, it's not far away and again we're probably going to be just inside. That 30 zone is going to be just in front of this station. So we need to be careful when we do accelerate. I probably only need to look at a video and just just to see when, like, I mean, it probably has a lot to do with the the, the actual loadout of the, the train, how heavy it is. But you probably need to start if you're at say you're at thirty, you need to start breaking at a certain distance. I mean, I. Mm -hmm. I'd probably say start breaking at about 500, 400. Oh, still in power there. Right, we're on step to 200. I think we're actually, I think we're going to be not too bad. Maybe come off the brake a little bit. Maybe just go back into step one. Oh, we're actually going to be in almost perfect time. Just a little bit over, but that was that was a, a little bit better. Oh, open the doors. Oh. Trying to nudge that, that button to the side there. <sighs> so actually, kind of lost a little bit of time there, but maybe fumbled with the door opening button. So we should be leaving. What I'm going to do is... See, sometimes you can not take that break off. Probably you really should keep at least some of it on. Right, door's locked. I'm just a little bit late in this departure. Pollock Shields West. 11.28. And we do have a 30 zone, so we can't... We need to remember that in about 500 yards. I'll maybe go just up. Oh, my cat's seen my windscreen wiper. Right, we'll just go above because we can bleed off a bit of speed, probably. Coming up. Just apply a little bit of brake, just get it down to 30. There's the 30 board. Right, we need to go probably I, th I, th I think we're going to get away with this one <laughs> see that's where it, uh, it really catches you off guard oh, this should be a perfect stop actually or oh, pretty decent uh, yeah that's, that's almost perfect let's 
go down to step one break. Do 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 do. <sighs> oh, I was really probably really shouldn't have closed the doors. Do you know what? I'm I'm going to open the doors again. I think we've loaded all the passengers, but. Kinda, we're kinda early. I've well, made up some time. Probably really wasn't worth it to be honest. Right, let's get the brake off. Let's engage the power. There we go. Get the window up. So next stop is Glasgow Central, where this train will be terminating. So we've got a 30, but we've got a 25 zone coming up. We'll power up. We'll get it to 25. Oh. Oh, did you see that? That was almost like a blue sky. Wow, that was quite nice. Oh, 15. Oh, no, was that? I'll start breaking actually because we've got a uh, 25. That 15 board, I just seen it. That was uh, that was code brown for a second. Right, 25. Right. Twenty-five was almost. Oh, wow, that was uh, a bit of a bit of freeze there. Look at that window open, it's getting a bit steamy in here, it's a bit humid. So we've got 20 and half a mile. Let me just, a little bit of power up, get up to 25. I think time wise, I think we're... I think we're on, uh, on the money in terms of time. Train Sim World is, is it's quite an expensive game. You really just buy the modules that, that you want. So like Glasgow Central for me was always going to be something that I was always watching out for when it went on sale. Um, because it's a, it's a, I mean I've been in Glasgow Central quite quite a number of times. So coming into Glasgow Central, it's quite familiar for me. And the station itself is actually really quite nicely modelled. As I say, this game, it's not one that, that I play like day in, day out, but I quite like to pick it up every now and again. And just play it, and just kind of relax. Oh, we need, we've got a 20 coming up, so get it down a little bit. There's a 20 board there. It's probably not a board, it's like a sign, but I just call it a board, I don't know why. So, we're almost a point where I think we're actually probably ahead of time. I don't know if the game's got like a... In fact, we're all... Probably a little bit of break, we're in a little downhill section here. It'd be quite nice if the game had a, like a plus or minus like X amount of seconds so that you could you know if you had quite a long distance to go you could actually work out you know if you're ahead or you're behind so you could make up time or whatever oh 15 zone oh brakes
that caught me off guard there a little. So it's 15 all the way into Glasgow Central. And we're due to arrive at 11.35, it's 11.32, almost 11.33, so we're actually, we're actually quite ahead. Imagine being, like, on time, um, you know, I think, I think, uh, I'd rather be just slightly ahead as opposed to behind, but right, maybe start applying some brake probably just need to go step one it's going to be a nice smooth entry here oh that should be perfect that should be absolutely bang on Maybe a little bit over, but not by much. There we go. Yeah, that was pretty good. But just, yeah, we're kinda, we're kinda close there. Let's get these wipers off. So I think we're actually, yeah, we're actually ahead. We should open the doors. Well, I mean, we could open the doors at 11.30. 35, sorry. Oh, sorry. But yeah, this is really quite, I mean, the shop windows look a bit naff, if I'm honest. But this here is all authentic. Like, the air, usually when I get the train, I'm, I'm up this part here. Up here. But it's modelled uh, pretty good, to be honest. Let's get that window up. Um, so I take it I need to... Oh, there we go. I was, I was about to take the, the key out. So I think we actually did pretty well. 11,123 we did. A 35 minute journey, 9.7 miles, so we, we've got the gold. Anyway, that is going to conclude this little video. Um, as I say, it's a game that I do enjoy. Uh, I think it's quite relaxing. Hope you liked it, and I'll see you for more videos coming up soon. Take care, catch you next time. Bye.